Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is TayJ and today I'm going to be showing you 10 of the cutest little creature mods to use in Minecraft. And I've got some absolutely adorable and super random little mobs in this video. So I really, really hope you enjoy. Don't forget to like and subscribe and as always, comment down below which is your favorite and let's get straight into the video. Alright, so the first little creature of the video is Chester, and Chester is essentially a tiny little chest mob that runs around and is a form of storage. Chesters can be tamed with iron nuggets and they will follow you around as your little portable storage and I think they're absolutely adorable with their cute little eyes. And then the mod also introduces a large form of Chester that is a boss battle which is really adorable and fun at the same time. Next up we have Cactoids, and Cactoids are essentially cute little cactus mobs that just wobble all around the desert. These are from the Final Fantasy VII mod, and there are three variants of Cactoids, including the regular Cactoid, Flowering Cactoid, and Cactites. All I'm saying is I want to command a little army of Cactoids. Next up we have lily tads, and lily tads are one of the cutest little mobs in this video and they are essentially a little lily pad mob that camouflages themselves underwater with a cute little lily pad with a flower on top of their head and then the way they wobble around and their cute little eyes are one of the most adorable things in this video. Next up we have shroomies, and shroomies are these adorable little mushroom mobs that roam around these mushroom biomes and they are the cutest little innocent creatures. The better mushroom mod introduces some larger mushrooms as well as cannibalistic mushrooms even which are quite scary, but shroomies are by far the cutest part of this mod and I would love to see them in vanilla Minecraft. Next up we have straw golems, and straw golems are one of my favourite mods in this video. I love them so much. You make them by placing a pumpkin on top of a piece of hay, and then these little guys will farm for you. So they essentially run around to the closest farm, and they will harvest the crops and put it in the closest chest to them. These guys are one of the few mobs in this video that while being absolutely adorable, they also have a really functional purpose, and I think would be really really good to have a bunch of these guys in your Minecraft world. Now we have cute hermit crabs, and this mod introduces a bunch of adorable little hermit crabs that are red and white in colour, and they spawn in beach biomes. These little hermit crabs are non-hostile, so they will not attack you, and you can even breed them with seagrass or kelp. You can even craft a new helmet with hermit crab shells that gives you resistance 3 if you're sneaking. The next mod is Waddles, and Waddles is a cute little penguin mod that spawns in snow biomes and ice biomes, and they provide a great atmosphere to these biomes, and they just waddle all over the place. Waddles is one of the most popular penguin mods out there, and it's because of the detail and just how cute the little penguins are. Next up we have the Spoonbill, and the Spoonbill is an adorable pink elegant bird which is a part of the Cooper's Critters mod. Spoonbills have this pure elegance about them which makes them absolutely beautiful and they spawn in typical biomes that other Minecraft birds spawn in. The second to last mod of the video is Mini Blooms and the Mini Bloom is essentially the cousin of the Mushroom and it is a yellow cow that has flowers growing off of it. These guys only have a really really small size, they don't grow bigger than what you see right now and they are absolutely adorable. Mini Blooms are also super super rare and they can only be found in flower biomes but then you can also make them sit with glistening melons if you come to find one. Alrighty guys, the last mod of the video is Cute Puppy Mod, and this mod adds a bunch of multicolored cute little puppies to the game, and some of these guys can be tamed, and some of these guys even have themes such as Ender Puppies, and even puppies that mimic Minecraft skins. Alrighty guys, that brings us to the end of this video. Thank you so so much for watching, I really really hope you enjoyed, and comment down below which one of these 10 mods was your favourite. Don't forget to like and subscribe, it really really helps me out. I love you guys a lot and I will see you guys in the next video.